Hi guys, in this video we're just going to talk about uh, bony landmarking of the thoracic spine. So, it's just a quick overview of what we call the root of three. So we have, if we segment the vertebra in three sections, T1, T2, T3, T4, T5, T6, T7, T8, T9, 10, 11 and 12 separately, we can segment them and we can decide uh, where the transverse process are in relation to the uh, spinous process. So for T1, 2, 3, very quickly, we have the transverse process in line with the spinous process. For 4, 5 and 6, we have the spinous process or the middle, uh, half a segment below the transverse process for landmarking. And below that again, uh, 7, 8, 9, we have the spinous process, one full segment below the transverse process. And then respectively, T10, half up, T11, half up again and then T12 is in line with our transverse process at the bottom at a roughly, where, roughly where our 12th rib is. Now for a quick landmark again on that if we're mapping that while a patient is on the table um, roughly our T3 is at our superior angle of the scapula if we run across it would be roughly T3 and then the inferior angle or border of the scapula should be a T7 for a quick landmark. If we pat the patient down to the bottom rib on the, the inferior aspect of the ribs, very laterally, we can find that 12th rib and track across, that's going to be T12. Thanks for watching.